what's the signs? I hope you guys are doing well. I already shuffled and split those two for you. We're finishing up the tarot now. You feel that shit going on? And who is it? Earth signs. Their ex definitely feels the shift going on. So let's see what's going on with the water signs. See how you guys are doing, okay? All right, so let's do a split. And then we can move forward. We can get up out of here. You feel me? Boom. All right, let's start off with the moonology. Let's see what's good and what's going on with the water signs. All right, let's see what's going on with the water signs. Oh. New moon in Pisces. A tune to the divine. That's right. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. And first quarter moon in Aries. Step into your power, my dear. That's right. Step into that power, my dear. Do that for me, please. <sighs> come on. Come on. Okay. So these two bad boys out the way. Now let's see what's going on with these water signs. First and foremost, it looks like it's time for us to tap into that, that primal energy. All right, and we have to move forward and understand that we are divine beings and understand how we operate. All right, where our power comes from. Oh, sorry about that. Looks like we're taping, taking a leap of faith and beginning a new journey. Okay, so what about this journey? What are signs? What's going on with this journey? What are signs? This is an emperor on this journey. Okay, this is the masculine energy on this journey. Now, maybe he's a gifted energy, maybe he's very spiritual. Okay, maybe it's a tarot reader. Oh no, he's on a passionate. He's he's about to have a very passionate experience. He is. All right, now he's moving quietly, moving in silence, which I do like. Step into your power, two to the divine. This dude very much is in his highest form, highest power right now. We have the death. He's transformed from a wounded warrior. He's gone through some sort of enlightenment and is now a high priestess emperor energy. Okay, so what's going on? All this great, powerful, strong energy. Talk to me. What are signs? King of Swords, you're a very skilled energy. Maybe you're a scholar. Maybe you recently come out of a relationship of some sort. Nonetheless, you're looking for truth and clarity. You look like an authoritative figure. And it also looks like the wheel is spinning in your favor. Okay. Okay. I'm liking that. Nine of Cups. Eight of Cups. Okay, so it looks like the one you loved walked away from you, Emperor. Yes. All right, the one you wanted this passionate pursuit or passionate quest with. All right, may have walked away from me and broken your heart. Okay, secretly. You kept this to yourself. You're still moving forward on that journey, it looks like. All right. Okay, you're still going towards your Ten of Pentacles, generational wealth and success. Somebody isn't going to deter you from that. And I respect it. I respect that big and big Aries energy. Okay. All right. Okay. What are signs? Let's talk about it. Okay. Ten of Pentacles on the table. Okay. So Page of Swords. Somebody's watching the water signs. Okay. The water gangs. Okay. Apparently you have a future in giving counsel, my dear. Okay. It's something about Ten of Pentacles, generational wealth, success, very comfortable, lavish lifestyle because you have the means to do so and also highly respected and favored within your community. Very good. Very good. I love it. I love it. Okay. So it looks like you may not be aware of this, but this emperor is going to be celebrating where he's going. Yes, he is. All right. It's looking like this beginning, this, this new journey, this passionate quest of him being some sort of teacher where he's teaching and giving counsel, creating this generational wealth is uh justice for separating from this queen of swords. Or maybe it's also... I'm not sure. I'm feeling as if in this new beginning, there will be a partner for this energy to work with who will be a queen of swords. Intelligent, chatty, witty, beautiful discernment. A master of her discernment. Okay, let's talk about this queen of swords. She's a wounded warrior. She's been through a lot. Okay. Not a cup. She's she's charming. She's sweet. Okay, okay. Queen of Queen of Queen of Swords. Talk to me. Talk to me. Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords. 
the magician. This is who you've manifested. This is the partner you've manifested in your new beginning order signs. So, oh, so you manifested someone who's a little rough around the edges. Okay, nothing wrong with it. Okay, you know what you like. Very good. Okay, so it looks like you guys will be able to work together as well. It'll be a very beautiful, balanced, fair uh, situation. You guys both seem to. You guys both seem to be intellectual thinkers. I like that. You, on the other hand, are some sort of counselor, advisor, and that's going to be where your generational wealth is coming from. And your a partner being a part of this is a bonus, honestly. Okay. Looks like you may have been betrayed and had to move forward with the chariot there. Yes, you did. You're forced to move forward after being betrayed by a knight of cups, I want to say. Okay. Mm. Okay, ten swords to the back. And you were just giving to this energy blindly. Look at this. Eyes closed, eyes closed, eyes closed. You were just giving to this situation. You thought this was your emotional fulfillment. And your intuition actually led you away from this situation. Thank God for your intuition. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, yeah, you moved up out of there, baby. He was like, nah, I'm sorry. I know my worth. I can't do this. Was it rough? It was hard because clearly you were planning on, you know, investing in this energy. Okay, the star. Yeah, you thought that was your wish fulfillment. All right, you were ready to go towards this energy and balance energies. And now you're very much defensive and standing your ground. But understand that you're moving with success. Okay. Okay, very good. Anything else for the water signs? Somebody's having anxiety. And I want to say it's this person that... Yeah, yes, yeah, broke it off with or you're no longer with anymore. The one that we had to walk away and our intuition had to lead us away from them. Yeah, so they want to come back and re redeem themselves. They're seeing things from another perspective. They're maybe they've maybe I'm not saying they have maybe they've gone through some sort of enlightenment and now they're feeling more grounded, wanting to be a stable masculine energy. All right, wanting to provide the foundation. And also take action, all right? Take action in this situation, right? So they can truly redeem themselves and move forward. Maybe they see the marriage, possibly. They might possibly see marriage uh, with you, but I don't know what are sign dudes. Yeah, exactly. They created a burden for you to carry, all right? They're just lit they're literally watched you carry this burden, what are signs? All right, they literally watch you carry that burden. Look at you. All right, and you were confused. You weren't realizing what was going on. You were just, all right, I got this. We're going to make this work. This is going to work out. And they were literally watching you carry the burden, the problem. Boom. While wow, they gained a perspective of things. Okay. Very good. Oh. Mm. So they're hermiting, watching with the Seven of Swords. All right, so they have a hood on. They're hiding, but they're, they're, they, they want to be seen. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. The devil maybe they're obsessing about this but um they're definitely in your energy water signs okay they're, they're remaining strong why are they remaining strong why do they have armor on why are they remaining strong you want to take action they're remaining strong because they have a pages offer they want to come forth and give you an offer what is this offer symbolizing Queen of Wands. Oh, okay. So they want to match you. They see you as very attractive. I'm very confident. Okay. Wants to hit the redo button on that one. Okay. Three of Swords. Five of Swords. So they want to surrender and defeat. They want to talk about things. They want to try to make amends. All right. Oh, man. Man, 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 man. Okay. So uh, we're going to leave this one here for the water guys. Congratulations on taking your, the initiative and the authority to move forward on your new beginning. All right. It looks to me that you do have another intellectual queen of swords on the other side of this. And it's because you separated from the queen of swords that was here before. So congratulations on that. Keep going with your work. This is beautiful. The advice that you're giving, it's going to lead you right where you need to be at the appropriate time. 
So remember, faith without works is dead. All right. So keep moving. Keep striving. You are the emperor. You are on your brand new beginning. You're a very skilled energy. You're balanced within your energies and you're also being granted a passionate new beginning. So honestly, you're this is beautiful. All right, you're the work that you do, the contribution you do to our community, to our society is fabulous. The Hierophant and the Ten of Pentacles. All right, maybe this was your dream. Maybe this is something you manifested. Because me personally, Hitch, I want to be Hitch. I've always wanted to be Hitch. And this looks like Hitch to me. So we're going to leave this right here, Water Signs. You keep this fabulous energy up. Whatever you decide to do with this energy, please pray and meditate over everything and anything before you do anything and then um allow the most high to guide you all right i love you all mucho mas thank you guys for being a part of this reading and uh yeah take i'll see you soon love and light guys